Hi guys, Indigo Pistis here. Hope everybody's doing amazing. And if you don't know who I am, I'm a smile caster, life coach, and the list goes on. And you can find all my information in the description box below this video if you need any form of services. And more services are explained on my website. So I wanted to explain demonic position, the truth about demonic position. There seems to be this major misunderstanding based on the program of humanity. So I've written down a few um, points that I would like to just explain to you guys real quick. The first one, the 72 Goetia, okay, will not possess you to the point where you go into this self-destruction mode. If you feel that you are losing all sense of self, I'll explain further what exactly is happening. Next one. So some apparent positions, okay, apparent positions are not actually positions they are psychosis you are going through a psychosis a mental meltdown the mind body and soul is not working as one there is no proper connection or link this can cause a mental psychosis which will push if you use any form of mental illness to the next level which means you will get paranoia and the list goes on this is why i always say mentally healthy be mentally healthy if you connect with spirit so if the individual as i've just said is not mentally healthy they can project those negative programmings onto the physical reality which can be perceived as a position as i said before so the number one cause of actual positions and i think most of you know this that are you know, you know the occult, you understand the, the occult a lot better. The number one cause of possessions are intranquil spirits who desire to live their life through you, who will also take your energy because they need it. They are losing energy because they are not moving to where they need to do to re to where they need to go to repower themselves, and then they get a choice to return or travel further so they stay and when they stay they need energy and they take it from you they also get an opportunity to live through you so the number one causes of possessions are in tranquil spirits many can possess one person which means that person and this is on a spiritual level we're not talking about any form of psychiatry right now the person can have many moods okay and this can take a toll on the current of the body. So the energetic flow starts to malfunction. And this is why I always say mind, body and soul goes at, at, it goes all in one. If you are wanting to grow spiritually, but you don't take care of your body, forget it. There's going to be an imbalance, vice versa. You take care of your body, but you don't care. take care of your spiritual self. There are things that you are not doing. There's going to be a blockage. You won't be able to go any further. So it's very important that before you even try to endeavor and go on these amazing uh, spiritual endeavors and, and, and connect with spirit, that you first connect with yourself. And I've said it many times before, first find the God within yourself before you find the God outside of yourself. And this is why I also do three-day sessions where I help people find the God within themselves. Along with that three-day sessions, I also teach the student, the client, how to connect with the ancient ones and how to connect with the higher self. So you get to learn how to see the God and the goddess within yourself and how to connect with an ancient one. Some call it a, a demonic entity which were demonized. The list goes on. So I just wanted to inform people so that people have a better understanding out there. What is demonic possession? And this was just a, I can't say a quick read because I spoke, but a, a short version. Just to give you some form of understanding, a foundation, a basis to go from. So guys, stay tuned for more content. Like and subscribe and bye for now.